Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Hollywood Show now here, about to give you another Injustice 2 video slash live stream. If you're watching this on Twitch, you'll get to see it a little bit early, but if you're watching the YouTube video, thank you very much for your support. So, we're going to start off by reading some Discord comments. We're going to read our Twitter and Instagram, which absolutely got fucking destroyed while I was at work. A ton of likes in both. So, let's take a look again at this post, as I did read it before I started recording, but we're going to read it again. So... Widowtaker, Salad Sexual, I don't know if he's related to Metal Gear Salad. Thank you for your feedback. While I do not have any information on the specific gifts you contacted us about, I can confirm that players may occasionally receive gifts from the game or community teams for being active members of the community or from contests, promotions, giveaways, etc. While I cannot provide you with Arkham Knight Batman, I will pass along your feedback about this situation to the game and community teams. There's a bunch of stuff going on Reddit. 100 likes, wow, at 446. That's beautiful. Notice our hate. <laughs> you showed my post. Thank you for watching the Twitch stream, by the way. So let's take a quick look at Instagram. You saw there was a post about 100 likes. We are currently, yeah, we're at 100 likes right off the bat. But a lot of comments from people. Robbie with the support, love it. Victor Ackerman, Elficky, Kella, Dabon. I'm not going to say it. I know you guys want me to. Elijah is B17. The Aquib. Mazin0513. Showing support. Second one in the chest today. We'll see if I can promote him. Uh, Kieran Sierra Arfin Hakimi. One of my regulars, especially in the Mortal Kombat X days. Thank you very much for your support. Now, next up, I'm going to show you guys the Instagram post, which I don't think is influenced by this. But we'll see. So, this was the email that I got from... Uh, Bishop Eaton, also known as BlazeGoodBoy2000 at gmail.com. I just sent this, but messed up the email. I'll do a quick of what I had said. I was wondering if for my birthday you could give Hollywood Shono a one-star Arkham Knight Batman as a present for me, as he has spent well over $1,000 on your game and will spend more on offers, although it doesn't matter for such a big company. I was just trying to, as I'm a very optimistic kid, thank you and have a great day, Bishop. Well, with that said, I'm going to quickly pop over to Injustice 2 Mobile, and I'm going to show you guys the inbox that is 150,000% legit. Then we're going to go to Twitter for all the positive comments there. So, as you can see, the legendary Arkham Knight Batman email is legit. That is not fake. Now let's go over to Twitter. Thank you, uh, Chowder, for that support. I appreciate it. Uh, thank you, How to Green Lantern. You're not uh, related to Metal Gear Salad. I thought that was a cool name, though. Whoever came up with that, very creative. All right, so... Let's look at the uh, Twitter post. All right, so we're looking at the Twitter post now, and this is what I made early in the morning. Folks, fuck you, NetherRealm has officially ended, and if it was Bishop, thank you for the birthday request. I'd also like to take a little shout-out to a couple of my Twitch regulars, Ocean Goose and Super Stubs, who've also contributed over $200 each in support of my quest for Arkham Knight Batman. And I'd like to say Reddit, Twitter... Discord, Instagram, we fucking did it, guys. Thank you very much for your support. So, how to Green Lantern says, is that edited? No, and I think that's just the other comments. And J Stubbs, no way, that's awesome. And this will crack me up when uh, I tried to send a happy birthday, but you know what? It's still cool that they acknowledge them. So, kudos for trying, Jordan Powell. Sorry you missed out. Maybe you'll get one eventually, but. Like I said, make videos for four and a half years and try. You guys have to remember, those of you guys that are late bloomers to the Hollywood Shono channel, I've been making Injustice Gods Among Us one video since April of 2013, when the game debuted, and all the way through soft launch of Injustice 2. So it's not like I'm just sucking dick. I'm actually working to try to promote their game and give back to you guys by providing you quality content. And though you guys can remember, I have done two promotional offers in the past. I did one for the Suicide Squad update, and I also did one for the Blood Rubies in Mortal Kombat X when that first came out, as they provided me with all of the max gear for free in two sponsored videos. So, it's not like I haven't done things for NetherRealm in the past, so hashtag thank you NetherRealm. Please leave that in the comments down below if you're watching this from YouTube. And Akito says, the world is salty at you, dude. I think you've made it halfway. And Shawshank Harsh 
You guys know that I say welcome to the God of Assholes Club whenever somebody subscribes to me or follows me on Twitch. I stopped doing the follows on Twitch because I was getting somewhere in the neighborhood of 100 follows a day. And that just gets ridiculous and annoying, but that's kind of funny. So Jason also said, totally deserve it. Only wish you saw it on stream so we could hear you scream about it. See you in tonight's stream. Congrats, bro. How did you get Legendary Arkham Knight Batman that's sick? The curse has finally ended. I'm saving up gems because I know that if I get him and the offer, I need to take it. And How To Computing also chimed in. That's freaking epic. And Flying DBZ HD. Yo, dude, that's fucking awesome, man. Congrats, bro. Bro. And Hockey Man in the stream finally after about a week and a half. Slacker, thank you for showing up. So let's go over a couple of photos before we actually unlock the car. Just to give you guys kind of some of the stuff I've been going through. So first off, Hacker Alert. Hacker Alert. Preheated Snail. How the fuck do you have two characters with level 60 gear? Get the hell out of here. Lawrence 979 is also somebody that I believe I've seen either in Twitch or comments. Uh, Grizzle of the Core I've probably run into about a dozen times. Whenever you get lag when you're on the freeway when you're playing Injustice 2, you get some cool shit like this that pops up. Really cool. And what better way to kill a Sub-Zero? Clone a Sub-Zero. We also got my big fat cock. We got Shoto Morrow representing the God of Assets Club. By the way, what I'm also talking about with Injustice 2 BR, I really like what they're doing. So when you see people with the Shono tag in front of their name, that's in support of Hollywood Shono and also showing support, hopefully getting leagues in the next update. So those of you guys that are showing your Shono support, thank you very much. And how to JYSA, I think is a how to person. But you know what? That's pretty cool. Also glad to see that. Unileska, I've seen on the leaderboards quite a bit. Uh, Foxworthy I also ran into once. Uh, Ghost Singer, one of the 535,000 threat people. Another run, please stop deleting these guys. I know I made videos on Kratos and the other guy. We need these guys to compete with LQ, Bat, whatever the hell his name is, no longer Persona, and Crazy 666 Evil. Don't delete these guys, please. We need to farm them. I also ran into Mikey's box once at 102,691 threat. Isaac Casanova, every team I've run into of his actually has less threat than mine, but when you have a Predator, Batman, Dr. Fate, and even a Flash, you're probably going to be able to beat the 500k teams because you have chip damage. As long as you have a little bit of defense, you should be all right. And we also got Black Lulu, Respect for the God of Assholes Club. We also got Jay Wolf, who also has that pretty cool-looking armored suit, man. I wonder how these people are getting those max out, guys. I'm really not sure. And we also got uh, Nishan, THBK007. I'm not sure who he actually is. I know that he probably went through a mental breakdown last season as he's nowhere in the top 50, but please don't be an asshole like this and split your teams if you're not going to be playing. Don't be like LQ Persona and leave in a garbage team. Let us farm you. I'd really appreciate it. At least Dark by Design does it. We got you fucked up, and we got the preheated snail again with a garbage team. So again, I don't know how he got that shit so quick. We got Zach is gay. We got Big Titty Life, who was in the top 200. I'm not sure if he's still there, but I fucking love this name. We also got one of my loyal subscribers, Coster one m Thank you very much, by the way. Really appreciate you. Is this the same Kratos that got banned? I'm really curious. We also got AV likes Jake Paul, so I guess AV is a faggot. We got Shono Mario again. We got Love for How to Computing and I Shono. Thank you very much, bro. I did post that on Instagram. We got Shono K3P26. I'm not sure who this is, but much respect for you as well, bro. And we got Huza, everybody's favorite troll on YouTube. We got Fag Cartman. I'm not really sure how creative this one is, but I'm guessing this was when Cartman was going through his uh, breakdown phase. And who knew that you could actually make a nose out of characters? This is fucking hilarious. We got my boy, You Know Me Too, who has been in my streams on Twitch. Much respect to you, bro, if you're watching this live on YouTube or Twitch. Show no nuke beast. Well, hope to see you at some point. We got Are You Okay? Why Me? What the fuck is up with some of these names? Hilarious. Aaron, how you doing, my dude? And this guy, this person has also been in my streams, as you can see by the donations. She looked level 18. Hilarious. We got Honeyless Badger. I don't know if he's a regular on the Injustice Forum, but the name is definitely familiar. And we got my homeboy, Elfiki, who's actually doing really good on YouTube. Great to see that, bro. Keep getting subscribers. I want to be there when you hit 1K. What the fuck kind of name is this? He got Big Dick. And this is when I made the weird icons when somebody said you could hold the button down. And this is actually pretty cool. I'm not sure how you do this. Igor Yuxa in circle text. That's pretty cool. 
And we got my homeboy, Evel Morrow. If you're in here, please give a shout out because I know that you might be working, but I know that you tried to get in here. But hopefully, you did make it. We got Taku, who is definitely a top 20 person regularly. Much respect for him. I think he was in one of my YouTube streams at one point. Dragon something. And who remembers this lovely glitch? See, power of two settings in texture editor. How you got this was last left the Joker when you equipped all of his gear. That's what his portrait turned into. Fucking hilarious. That will go down in the history of stupid glitches. We got my homeboy Atromix. Much respect to you, who also did Atromix bracket AGWS because Dash Shona would not fit, which is five versus six. So much respect to you, bro. We got Obama Bin Laden. That's a hilarious one. We got my homeboy Carmel the God. Much respect for you, sir. No, I can't wait to see you in my league. We also have a comer. Swamp Thing must be hitting Wonder, Wonder Woman and Harley Quinn as a threesome. And we got my homeboy George before he was a dumbass and broke up his team. Please put death, Deadshot back on your team. Oh, and by the way, State Lover playing ARMS on the Nintendo Switch. And this was at Big Boys. How cool is it to be able to play video games on the go? Oh, we got uh, Gia June. A lot of you guys might recognize him. Consistent top 50 player on the leaderboards. Heard he's also one of the Injustice 2 uh, mobile com community people. So, much respect to him. We also got your mom's big black cock. That was actually done right with Cyborg. Much respect for using br the silver Cyborg portrait. And who remembers this guy? What happened to him? Did Alex Moyes Freyer actually get banned? Remember his team? We got one of my uh, friends, DRC Views TV. Good to fight you. And who remembers when J Wolf had 231,000 threat? You guys remember that? This one, this name was awesome. Dr. Fate DDS. Whoever came up with this name, you're a fucking genius. Vic100, how you doing, man? We got Big Black Cock. We got Faggy Chris. We got Ben Jacking Off. We got Wet Pussy. How do you do this, by the way? You see Abdullah's name all the way off to the right? How do you do that? That's pretty hilarious. This name is fucking awesome. Rumble J. Trump. Oh, and we got the fake Hollywood Shona. Look at that. Hollywood Shona. We can tell this kid is a fan. So thank you very much for supporting Hollywood Shona, but please spell my name right. We got Mr. Sugar Dick. And instead of nigger faggot, we got figure nugget. We got Bill Cosby's STD. And who remembers when I changed my name to How To Computing just to get him number one on the leaderboards? That was a good moment. See, if I had no life, I could hit number one easily every day. Like, if I had unlimited gems and time, there would be no doubt I would be the WWF champion. This, this one cracked me up. Super Harambe, but he's not using Harambe. This one is very true as well. I also got my homeboy Hockeyman7776. I fought once. You guys have probably seen that before. Delta, how you doing, my friend? Yes, thank you very much. And when you watch my streams, if you pay $4.99 to subscribe, use your Twitch Prime membership, which I know some of you guys have, you can get no ads on my streams. Uh, when you play Hearthstone and you're going up against a Taunt Cthundrun, what do you do against this board? Unreal. Fucking great. All right, let's get into what you guys are all here for. And that would be the legendary Arkham Knight Batman. So, thank you for all of your support over the years, NetherRealm. So, for that, thank you, NetherRealm. Oh, baby. That's what I'm talking about, ladies and gentlemen. That's why I say 4,500 gems. Beautiful. Beautiful. Five-star Arkham Knight Batman. Batman. Yes, sir. Mario7461 with the subscription. Thank you very much, bro. Welcome to the Elite God of Assholes Club. We're going to promote Arkham Knight Batman all the way up. I'm probably not going to be able to buy his abilities, but look at that. We did it, Reddit. We did it. Yes, sir. Time to make some people pissed off on Discord.
Okay, bro. Do I have shards to take all his gear to five? Yes, I do. Right on the ball, 1,000. Let's upgrade all of his gear up to level five. And we'll see what kind of threat we get with a level one. You know, I should make Arkham Knight Batman level one with level 60 gear. I wonder what kind of threat he'd get. Not that I should do that, but... It'd be funny. I have been making NetherRealm mobile content for years, so thank you very much, Delta. You know, and people can get pissed off all they want, but you know what? It's true. I make content for NetherRealm. I have put hundreds of dollars into the game, so I think it's justified. It's not like I'm putting 20 bucks into the game. I probably put near $1,000 into the game. You're right. And I'm going to continue to make content, including this video for you guys. Thank you, Mario. I appreciate that. And... Ladies and gentlemen, brand new sub Mario. Welcome to the League God of Assholes Club. I probably need a blocker, but I really, I'm really curious about this. Let's go find a team to go beat up. <laughs> Alright, good enough. Let's do this. Uh, today, Mikey's box. It was this morning at work. On the way to work. Begin. Exactly, Carl. Hey, you got your Twitch Prime back. That's sweet, dude. Alright, guys, let's see it. Arkham Knight Batman. Holy crap, that does some damage. It just one shot that Wonder Woman. Are you distressed? Push yourself harder. Uh. Yeah, that man got destroyed. So guys, the main use for... We probably should have done a dot hazard, but the main use for Arkham Knight Batman and why he's so powerful is the simple fact that his hazard damage increase does make certain abilities like Green Lantern's Blades not suck. 
It also has great synergy with Atlantean Armor Aquaman because it makes his power drain even more annoying. Let's see if we can actually make it work with Atlantean Armor Aquaman instead of Green Lantern. And let's see how annoying we can get with this setup. We're going to try not to do damage with Predator Batman because we know he can just annihilate. I don't really want to fight somebody lower, but again, this is kind of show off the strength of Arkham Knight Batman. Alright, so we have Wonder Woman in with Predator Batman. So we need to get the five bars to actually use that ability, assuming Aquaman doesn't die. Pretty close. You're drowning. Look at that damage. That's some respectable damage just from a landing armor Aquaman got. So let's get to four bars. We're gonna do it again and with no combo. <laughs> Pretty respectful damage there. And even the hazard by itself just does ridiculous damage. And keep in mind you control the battlefield because Aquaman power drain. So this is a really potent team. Obviously, you don't need Predator and Batman for this to work. You could have Dr. Fate, you could have another hazard, but yeah. And landing armor Aquaman dot is just too busted. I really wish they would put it as a special three, but they made it five in a special two, but yeah, I think it's a little bit overpowered. So if you like this little Twitch stream slash YouTube video promoting Arkham Knight Batman, now a brand new character to my roster, thank you NetherRealm. Please give this video a like rating, comment, subscribe, share this video amongst your friends, and as a favorite, check out my other Injustice 2 videos playlist, Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch, which are all Hollywood Shono, and have a wonderful day, kids www.youtube.com slash Hollywood Show Now. Subscribe, bitches!